As you guys can tell by the title of the video, Robesi Ramirez versus Jose Matias Romero. It's official. Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video. It helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So, originally the race of Ramirez was supposed to fight uh, Magdaleno, but Magdaleno suffered a uh, uh, an injury, Jesse Magdaleno. And now, here he is fighting Matias. A uh, fight will be taking place on the 29th of October, October 29, 2022. So it's coming up pretty soon. It's a very last minute replacement. Uh, fight will be the co-feature, the co-main event for the uh, Lomachenko versus Ortiz fight, which will be shown live on ESPN Plus over at the Hulu Theater in Madison Square Garden, New York City, New York, USA. And I gotta say, man, props to Top Rank and uh, you know the people behind this event because uh, for Ramiro, Romero to step in last minute, it's it's a good last minute replacement. It really is. Romero uh, is a 26 year old fighter from Argentina with a record of 26 wins, two losses, nine wins coming by way of knockout or TKO. He's coming off two wins in a row uh, back in April and back in June of this year over in Argentina against relatively unknown guys, but he's been in there against the likes of Isaac Cruz and Mikel Rivera last year. It was a tough year for, for uh, Romero, but he had good moments in the Isaac Cruz fight and uh, unfortunately, the Rivera fight, he, he, Rivera was just a little bit too much for him. Uh, but, you know, it's a good measuring stick to see how good uh, Robesi is right now. Uh, Isaac Cruz and, and Mikel Rivera failed to knock out or stop uh, Romero. So if Robesi Ramirez can knock him out or stop him or beat him in a more impressive fashion, that tells me that Ramirez is definitely belongs among the top 10, top 15 contenders right now at 135 pounds or 126 pounds, I should say, not 135, 126. Um, but yeah, uh, man, I wonder if Romero can make that weight though, 126. I mean, his last two fights were at 126. So he fought Rivera and Isaac Cruz at 135. Interesting. So we'll see we'll see what happens um it's a good again it's a very very good last minute replacement uh for Rom for romero to step in to replace magdaleno and uh, i look forward to watching this event um again espn plus uh live from the hulu theater in uh, the garden in new york city new york usa let me know your thoughts and comments thanks for listening thanks for watching and like always have a great day all right thanks